It's been a tense night in the Mauritanian capital, Nouakchott. On Saturday evening, the President Mohamed Wild Abdel Aziz was shot under mysterious circumstances. He was on his way back from a resort outside the capital when his convoy was attacked. Security was tight and there was a lot of confusion outside the military hospital where he was admitted for surgery. If this was a case of bad coordination between different military units, it should be made clear. We just need to know what's really happened. The official explanation was quickly given on national TV. The government says the president was mistakenly shot by a military patrol that failed to recognize his convoy. Several hours later, the president himself spoke on national television from his hospital bed. I'd like to reassure all Mauritanian citizens about the success of the surgery that has been conducted by a medical team. I congratulate them and I also reassure all the citizens that the incident took place by mistake by an army unit on an unpaved road in the area of Tawila. Thank God the danger has passed and everything is all right. Some opposition sources say Wild Abdel Aziz was deliberately shot by someone driving a car next to his. There are no details as to the identity of the shooter. President Aziz staged a military coup in 2005. He allowed the civilian government to be elected a couple of years later. But in 2008, he led a second coup that was followed by his election as president. Since then, he's taken a tough stance against Al-Qaeda in the Islamic Maghreb. He sent his army into neighboring Mali to strike at armed groups there. Mr. Aziz has outspoken political enemies and Mauritania has a long history of military coups. But an assassination attempt, that would be something new. Mohamed Val, Al Jazeera.